What a touching song. I miss my time with you. I miss my time. The Lord is saying he misses time with us. We need to talk to him more. Communicate with him more. Spend more time with him more. Amen? He said in his word, I'm a jealous God and he wants time with us. That's so important. So important. Thank you for your word, Lord. We're still talking about the love of Christ. Him being our greatest love last week. We're talking about Jesus Christ, our devout and passionate love. And then we told you devout means very sincere, seriously in love. Say seriously in love. Amen. And then seriously devoted to and heartfelt devotion and devoted in heart. We're talking about Jesus. Then we mentioned the word passionate, which is having or showing strong feelings. And our strongest feelings should be for Jesus. Say, my strongest feelings should be for Jesus. And Jesus so loved us. We should so greatly love him. We all come together to love him today. So we all come together to love him at the same time. All this love is for him. So all this looking for us, all this love in this house is for Jesus first. Amen. It's his, my love. They come together for me. Yes. We socialize around Jesus. Say Jesus. Jesus. In other words, that's not socialized, but spiritually come together for him. And it's what Jesus desires of you and I in pleasing him, in pleasuring him. So it pleasures him, and we're created to, to love him, that, we're, that we'll be, he will be pleasured by it. Yes. Say pleasured yes. by that love. Come on, turn me up a little bit more. Say pleasured yes. by that love. And so then I'm going to say this as, as moving forward, and then we'll get to the topic of, again, uh, another topic we were talking about. But I, was, I just thought about inspiration. Inspiration comes from God. Inspiration is not self-activated. God personally inspires man to come to him. If you're inspired by God, it's what God has done the inspiring. He's done the activating. He got it going. He got it started because you cannot just be inspired or love God of yourself, of your own. God has to be greatly involved for us to love him. Yes. How many understand? Amen. And so inspiration comes from God. How many glad to be inspired by God? And so I just want to, so just, this just, this, this, this in my heart before we came out. Inspiration comes from God. Inspiration is not self-activated. God personally, say that to me, God personally inspires man to come to him. All that are in Christ Jesus have been personal, have personal experiences of inspiration affection from God through his son Jesus Christ. So the inspiration I have, the affection I have, the passion I have, it comes from God. It's God birth. God working it in me to be inspired with him, to love him. Amen? He started it all. And so we're not just inspired of ourselves. We don't have passion just of yourself. I just decided to have passion. No, it's Christ in you that causes you to have true passion for him. Amen? Amen. And don't take this lightly because when you come across this sacred desk, it's something God has put in my heart just before I came out to let them know inspiration comes from me. Anybody inspired with me, anybody overwhelmed with me is because I've done a work. I started that process in them. Yeah. And you have to be willing to let him inspire you. He's not, he's not going to force it on you, but you have to have an open heart so he can, his love and his peace. And because out of the love of God comes inspiration. And out of the love of God comes uh, uh, passion and affection. And so you love, you love him, you love Jesus because he first loved you. So I love Jesus because he first loved me. He first loved us. He first loved us. He first inspired you. Come on, say, he first truly inspired me. In other words, even before you met Christ, you had some people may have inspired you, but not like Christ. Right. Say, so not like Jesus. Not like Jesus. Hallelujah. Jesus. So he first inspired you. He first loved you. He first had, had, had first the greatest